My name is Jacqueline Lopez from the multimedia team. Now today, we're going to be showing you the science fair of 2017. My name is Diana Mojica and we're in the science fair and we're going to look at the kindergarten projects which are behind me. I'm Escort Rico here at the Sally Howard 2017 Science Fair and here is a view of the first grade projects. My name is Jimmy Reyes Vasquez and I'm here at the 2017 Science Fair Projects of Sally B. Howard. And behind me are the second grade projects. Hello, my name is Elijah Johnson and I want to show you the third grade section. Hello, my name is Darren Rios, and I want to show you the fourth grade science fair projects. I'm Escar Rico here again with the fifth grade projects. Hi, my name is Omar Vasquez, and we're here at the 2017 Sally B. Howard's annual science fair. And here we are looking at this project called Art in Motion by Deanna. Tell us a little bit about your project. So what we did, we built dominoes, as you can see in the picture right here, these two. And then we, in, we made three rows, and each had a paint of cup in it. And then when they fall, they're going to push the cups of paint, and they're going to get on the paper. And here's uh, one of the papers, how they look like. Welcome back, and I'm here with Jackie Lopez, the creator of this project. What is your, what is your project supposed to do? So you, put, you grab magnets, then you put a battery on top, and then you put around some copper wire. This copper wire should, should start spinning because of the magnetic force. How did you come up with this idea? Um, basically, I was looking around websites, and this one looked mo most interesting to me, so that's how I chose my project. Welcome back. We're here with Janai and Jose, and they're going to tell us about their science fair project. What was your science fair project about? It's about a solar hot dog cooker. So what is a solar hot dog cooker? It's um, basically like a solar stove, but kind of weaker and slower than an actual stove. So how does it work? It works by you have to sit it out in the sun. Like you have to put something, you have to put like a type of food on it and just leave it there so the sun can cook it. Welcome back. Now today we have a person with their project called Blow Blow Balloon Pop. 
What is your name? Tatiana Hines. Can you tell us what you did for your experiment? Um, we took like bottles and we put separate different colors in them and different colored balloons and we put pop rocks in each balloon and we put the balloon on and they flipped the pop rocks in the bottle which like kind of can kind of made a little fizz and the fizz kind of blew up the balloon so what flavor did you use um not any flavor i used food dye but for the pot rocks i used watermelon watermelon okay was it easy to conduct this experiment um yeah actually because these are materials that you can use at home and yeah they're really easy to get so what happened that you did not expect to happen um well i expect the pop rocks to blow the balloons up a lot more than it actually did but i mean they didn't blow it up very much so